in this video we are doing a 350 mile review yep 350 mile review of the sketches max road 5 modeled here by young simon everybody back to the Lee Valley we're just out here during morning dragging our sorry about some uh, 16 mile long run but we're putting goal pace in it and so si decided to grab his sketches max row five now so si, 300 well, how many miles after today to just be over 350 350 miles so I think it's a really good time probably a little bit longer than we should have done but Really good time to come back in on the Max Row 5. Now, if you don't know about the Max Row 5, I'll tell you about it after this train. So we do love a pair of sketches on 40 months. And the Max Row 5 is no exception. It is that daily long run shoe. We've got full length hyper burst. We've got a H plate in it. And that's the shape of the carbon plate. Carbon infused plate, I think it is actually. And that sits just under the foot. But you won't see, but back there. <laughs> Uh, and that's there to really add stability and some propulsion. Um, you've got, I think, uh, he's running along, I think it's Goodyear rubber on the outsole. It definitely is Goodyear rubber. There we go. And that's sort of strategically placed on the sort of nobbles. Yeah, yeah, nobbles? Yeah, it's nobbles, a little I'll tell you what, spongy bit. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Stop two seconds. Uh, look, look. See that? Mark, <laughs> careful. <laughs> but yeah, so you've got that strategically placed. But what you do have on the bottom is a lot of exposed hyperburst. We'll come on to that. Fits true to size. Yeah. Uh, if you can get them. Now, I know there's a, a problem in terms of logistics for all shoe manufacturers out there at the moment. But sketches are suffering particularly bad as well with that. But if you can get them, they're about 100 quid. I think they're 115. Think. Yeah, 115 quid. It's so really cheap, really. Yeah, I mean, relative, it's cheap. And they're not they're quite fairly light for this, what they are. Well, this is the other thing. They are very light. I think they come in, I'll put it up on the screen, but they are about nine ounces, I think. From what they are, they look heavy, but they're not. Yeah, they are very light. But that's because of the nitro infused. I think that's one of the, the benefits. Yeah, true. Yeah, true. Right, so that's the sort of stats and features-ish. Bear in mind, we are out here running. Um, okay, next, let's find out he's been getting on with them. Oh, that's 350 miles. Oh, just before the space. Okay, so... so at, firstly, what you've been wearing them, pretty much everything for 350 miles. Long runs, short runs, not really tempo runs. Yeah. But you can do it, just takes a bit more effort. Yeah. But basically anything, yeah. Everything and anything. Going to the shops, <laughs> They're so comfy, aren't they? Oh, you just... What about wear and tear? Well, the uppers... Oh, camera's gone. <laughs> yeah, go on, camera's still here. The uppers are like new. Yeah. Nothing wrong with them, but soles, they, they've just gone through the mileage, like the exposed hyperburst. Yeah. It's just starting to wear out, get damaged. Well, it will do, but I mean, not being funny. But they still feel all right, to be fair. 350 miles in a shoe yeah. is what you want. They still feel good, though, that's the thing, but it's just you know when you get to the point you think, I should have a new pair right now. Yeah, that is the thing, isn't it? What, let us know in the comments, at what point do you change your shoes? Mileage wise, I would usually go maximum 300. Yeah, yeah. But they still feel fine, so. They still feel good after all this time. And I can't get another pair. No, you can't get another pair because. Uh, otherwise, would have. it's a surprise. He's been on Amazon every day trying to source a pair. We try to get him some from the US. Obviously, try to get some from Sketches, but we just can't get any. Huh? So they might turn around. So I say this view, review is pretty useless because I can't get them. But don't despair because. There will be a new version coming out, and if there are stock where you are, maybe you're in another part of the world. Worth trying. And they're available, I would definitely try them. And I think that's the message, I think from this video more than anything else is one, people worry about sketches in terms of durability, which I think is being proven otherwise today. You and, know, this, the, and this is down at towpaths. Yeah, we're on this sort of, look, we're on this sort of stuff. This is not like not your road. super smooth, tarmac you know in a housing estate we're up and down the rivers so they are they do wreck shoes but yeah i think we've disproved some of that stuff about 
sketch is breaking up easy. He's got 350 miles in them today, which shows you that the shoe can stand up to most things. So I think this is actually more of a message to, as always on 40 runs, check out Sketch's running shoes, people. It's not an advert. He's paid for them himself. But I do think there's a lot to be said from them. They're so comfortable. The Hyperburst is just that lovely blend in inside of straight out of the box. Straight out of the box. Soft but soft but firm. It's just it's that balance, isn't it? Yeah. It's so, so good. So stable as well. So stable. We had a H play as well. So so there you go, yeah. Although you probably can't buy the shoes, we would recommend you buying the shoes. <laughs> so really sorry about no value. No, but we have proven that sketches durability. durability is on point. Right, that's it. We'll catch you guys later. <laughs>